Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from Spirit and from all of our higher selves on this journey to love and back to reunion with our twins. And so the message today is about the angel number 1717. And also a message to say, no matter what is happening in your so-called connection, as in what you can see with your eyes and what is happening on this kind of reality is do not worry do not let it get you off um you know don't let it send you off track because it is there everything that you're doing or any of the let's call them the blips or any little thing that throws you off guard a little bit is there to make you go further and further into your heart for you to really trust in yourself and the feeling that you know that is within your heart. So, um, and we always, uh, we all experience those blips at certain times, all the time, you know. There can be something suddenly in the day and it makes you think, oh my goodness, is this real? What's happening? Da, da, da. And that's just the nature of the game because we are all waking up to our truth. And so waking up to our truth means that we have to dispel anything that isn't truth. And when that comes up, that feels uncomfortable. Um, but it's being brought up to be let go. So the number 1717 is all about, it's basically the manifestation of your heart's desire. And it is that you've, that basically you've reached the stage of life when the manifestation of your desires becomes your natural ability. So it's basically the marrying of your soul purpose, right, with your energetic vibrational frequency. So it means that you've done your energetic work and you are vibing in the frequency of your true soul path. And your true soul path will be with your twin in the end because you are vibing in the highest space of your reunion, right? And therefore, your reunion will then come in at the right time for you. And it is the manifestation of your heart's desire. So I love that because the song that is today's song is Black Star by David Bowie. Um, now, there are so many, there's so much symbolism in that, but six, the Star of David is the marriage of the Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, Divine Union. Um, on the song it has 17, which I knew it would because 1717 is the number that has been following me around all day yesterday. So, and with that I'm going to read letters number 57 from the divine love letter books and this is the message that wants to come out and i really feel this again really strongly so it is i want you to know that i think about you all the time every second of every day it's every thought that i have always comes back around to you i wish that you could be in my head just for one day and then you would have no doubt about our love for each other how I feel with you is without doubt the most powerful feeling I have ever experienced. As sure as night follows day and day follows night, we will be together. We are together. Trust that the feelings you have for me are reciprocated because we are two hearts coming together to build a beautiful whole. A whole that is so vast that you cannot comprehend with your mind. It is so vast it can fill a galaxy. Our love is beyond words and beyond what our eyes can see. It is the heart and the feeling of love that we are meant to be together forever. Okay, so it is saying no matter what is going on, remember that it's our hearts together that make a whole and so that feeling is so incredible um, that no matter how much we try and push it away it is always there so letter 57 from book two i think about all the amazing times that we're going to have with each other the incredible lives that we're going to make together living an incredible life Trusting in the universe to bring us magical experiences. A magical rainbow family. 
a magical existence where we can paint our rainbow colours on the world to bring light and colour into each other's life. That is what I think about, what I dream about. I think about us coming together in a beautiful technicolour merger of our bodies in a blissful state of eternal union. <laughs> oh, wow. How amazing. So, I think about us coming together in a beautiful technicolour merger of our bodies in a blissful state of eternal union. Well, quite amazing. <laughs> quite amazing. So, uh, 57 from book three is this. Don't be sad. Don't be sad for what we haven't got or what we are not doing because we are always doing everything together. Just imagine that I am your invisible friend and I am with you everywhere you go, enjoying the same food, the same experiences. That way you will never feel alone because you know that I'm always gonna be right by your side, holding your hand, taking you along this amazing journey called life. Remember to stay with me because we will be each other's love and light and life. Okay, well this one, when I saw that it was this letter, it really, really rings true because I definitely think feel today there is like a tinge of sadness and we sort of go through these, you know, every so often I'll have this real sense of like, um, a real sadness kind of like oh I want to be with you today I want to do things with you and kind of you know just do things with you today and it's definitely today is one of those days and so this letter here just reflects it completely so those are the messages today but definitely the messages from the universe is definitely saying 1717 it is combining the energies and the vibrations of the numbers one and seven and it is magnifying their influences so the influence being that you are basically manifesting your heart's desire you know you've got the the right all the right ingredients right it's you're in the right frequency so it's basically saying, keep on going. Trust, 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 right? Trust, trust, trust. It also indicates that you have an important soul mission and life purpose that involves teaching, communicating, and healing others, which is everything that this journey is about. So keep on going, keep trusting, keep believing, and keep just knowing that the most important thing is you and uh, making you feel all right in any way possible on this journey because um, that's the most important thing your health your happiness your emotional well-being um, your your ability to shine your light on the world is the most important thing and the your relationship with your twin will come in when the time is right for you and so it's about appreciating yourself, appreciating where you are on your path, appreciating everything that you are. All right, well, I hope that helps. If you want to have a letter, it's $10. If you want to have a healing or reading, all details are in the link. And I hope you have a great day. All right, take care. Bye.